I really wish there could have been someone who guided me on how to start programming. Because after my 12th, I wasted so much of my time understanding what is programming, what to learn. There are so many websites, so many YouTube channels. Which one to choose? Which one is the best one? And before coding, I have to choose a language. Like which is the best one? C++, Python, Java. And which one has the more scope? There is web development, app development, Flutter, iOS, blockchain, AI ML, data science. So many doubts. But you don't need to worry because I'm here to guide you. And I will share my experience, my mistakes so that you should not repeat them. And if you don't know me, then I am Akash. I recently completed my third year in computer science and engineering at MS Ramaya, Bangalore. So the roadmap which I came up from my past three years of experience is first learn the programming language, anyone. And in the second phase, explore. Explore the web development, app development, machine learning. And in third phase, you have to start doing DSA data structure and algorithms and after completing 50% of DSA or even just understanding what is DSA, how does it work, side by side you have to start your fourth phase which is nothing but learning the core subjects such as operating system, object oriented programming, database management and computer networks. And if you completely follow this roadmap then at the end within 2-3 to three years you will be the top 1% of the engineers in India and you will get the highest placement. And in this video, I'm going to talk about the first phase. So let's begin. Number one, foundation. So before starting programming or before choosing a language, your basic foundation should be clear. The basic concepts like why is programming? How did it get started? So before starting coding, I want you to watch the couple of videos from YouTube channel CS50. And the person who taught in this video is one of the famous teacher from the Harvard University. And I watched one to two videos and believe me, it's so much fun. And I guess in 2024, they uploaded more videos. So watch just two to three videos. That's it. Number two, which language to choose? C++, Java or Python. You can choose any one language from these three and apart from these don't go for other languages such as JavaScript. You can learn that that's easy but I prefer you to learn C++ or Java because these languages are a bit difficult compared to the Python and if you learn C++ or Java then you can easily switch to Python at any time. It will take just three to four days and which one I know? I know all of three. I started with C actually and then after two days I got to know C++ is the better version. So then I learned C++ and in my college they taught me python and java both languages and even in your college they will teach you all of three so you don't need to worry just start with anyone and if you still have a confusion like which language to choose then comment down below and i will make a detailed video on which language to choose number three best youtube channels see when i started programming i watched videos from so many different channels and i didn't stick to one particular channel so that's why i wasted so much of my time like which one is the better who is teaching the best and after so much of my time i figured out Code with Harry is the best one for the absolute beginners. Other channels are also good but they are not actually for the absolute beginners. If you have understanding of a particular language then you can watch the other channels too. And I would say watch all the videos from his particular playlist like C++ or Java. And if you don't like his teaching then absolutely you can switch to other channel. But the thing is you have to understand what they are teaching. Before going ahead, if you find this video helpful then do consider a subscribe and share with your friends. Number 4. Apps or Websites I watched both C and C++ playlist of the code with Harry but in the middle I felt he's wasting so much of my time by giving examples by repeating the same content yeah even though it's good but if I got to know if I understand then there is no need to take again and again different examples right so it depends on each and everyone's understanding capacity even though I was watching in 2x I felt he's wasting too much of time and then I figured out there are documentations for each languages so I tried to learn from websites documentation and I felt it's more clumsy that's why I went to the play store and I just randomly searched is there any app based on the C++ or Java and I got many apps and you can download anyone and they are literally free you can download anyone and most of them has the same content so after my 12th what i had done is i used to learn one topic from the app and then i watched a related video of code with harry like that i completed the whole c within three days yes it may shock you but yeah anybody can do that and my source of motivation was elon musk because uh, when i was reading his biography i got to know he completed the c language within just three days so i thought if he can then why not me and that was my motivation and i completed within three days to complete in three days you have to study at least 10 hours a day but i don't prefer you to do that you can learn easily it will take two to three weeks that's it not more than that and if you want to read from the websites then gfg and w3 schools these are the best ones or if you want you can explore other websites too so now your task is to first complete one language and then for the second phase and i'll be making a detailed video on the second phase otherwise this video will become too big and you are going to a new college so just forget whatever happened in your past in your 11 12 you are starting a new life if you are introvert then go and talk to everyone then make yourself extrovert because the first impression is the best impression so bring that the best version of yourself and do hard work and i will there to guide you if you are still watching then thank you so much and you can comment down i watched till the end and that motivates me and if you have any doubts then do comment below i'll definitely make a video on you bye